Welcome back everybody. So in this video we're going to go ahead and unbox this Campark TC18 2K 4G solar powered wireless live view PTZ trail camera. I think I got all that right. Uh, we're going to go ahead and then set it up after afterward and we're going to see how this works. I've had a few cameras that are similar to this that I've been really really happy with. So let's go ahead and open this bad boy up and see what we have in here. Right now this is listed on Amazon for $239. You've got your user's manual, you've got your Yacht Club uh, SIM card, and you get seven days free data when you set the camera up with this card. And then you can download the app and you can just recharge it right over the app. It's super easy. This is a positioning sticker to drill holes if you're going to put this up uh, on a wall or something, like as a security camera of some sort. Right here is your solar panel. One nice thing about this solar panel is it comes with an extremely long cord so you can get this high up in a tree or pole or building where you can get good uh, access to sunlight. It comes with a tree strap and right here is your actual camera here's your usb charging cable or data download if you want to uh, just take your videos or pictures straight from the camera to a computer this is an adjustable mount for your uh, solar panel you can attach the solar panel to the back of that and then adjust it depending on wherever the sunlight is coming from You've got three screws for that. And then right here you've got another mounting system. Okay, let's see what the camera looks like here. Okay, so here's your camera right here. Obviously this spins and moves up and down depending on how you're manipulating it on the app that, that we're going to download here. Right here is where your SIM card goes in and your data card. I believe it comes, uh, it does not come with uh, data card, so a SIM card or an SD card. And it does not come with an SD card. It does come with your data or SIM card. That comes with it. Uh, your power button's in there as well, as long as your reset button. How is it that they have this? Okay, so it's actually set up like this. So this is how it'll go on a tr on the tree, just like that. Let's go ahead and get this uh, app downloaded. So you're going to go over to your user's manual and right on the back of your user's manual is the app that you're going to need. So you just go ahead and get your iPhone or Android and you just scan it just like this. And then it comes up in the app store. And then you press iPhone. And then here is the app. And I have a few other cameras already attached to it, so I've just got to add this camera to it. And then you go over here to device. You press add device and then set up 4G device so you, at this point you've got to make sure you have power your SIM card and the uh, camera turned on and then you can pair so that's what I'm going to do now is get the camera set up with a SIM card so I've got my SIM card in, my SD card in. Now I'm just going to go and make sure this camera is fully charged on the charger. So once it's charged, we'll be back and we'll get it set up the rest of the way. 
Okay, so our camera is fully charged and we just turned it on till the blue indicator light was on on the front and then we just took and scanned this QR code on the camera and as you can see right here, it shows that camera. So I'm gonna click on it and now you can see that this camera is operating and showing you what you see excuse me on the on the app so now when you okay let's set this up over here it's going to be upside down but okay so i'm going to show you a little bit about the app you're seeing the view upside down but uh you can talk through it hey hey so you can hear me talking through it you can shut that off and then so you can hear me talking through it it's kind of delayed so it shows activity and you can just click on that and it'll show you the activity or the motion it sensed it's it's loading right now So you can see it's shooting in really nice 2K video quality right there. And then you can go back and you can watch the live feed, which is that right there. And you can take pictures whenever you want or videos whenever you want. You can access all the camera settings right here by going to that. You can go through all the different camera settings, set it, you know, however you want it. I did want to show you guys how I actually set these up so they're really, you know, easy to transfer from one place to another. I take a treated 2x4 or uh, any piece of treated wood that you guys can find. And I just mounted the camera to the bottom there. And wound all that extra cord up with the solar panel right on top and then I'll just mount this to fence posts using a uh, you know a drill bit with some screws and I'll put the fence posts in wherever I want them and then when I want to move them I just on drill them and take them somewhere else and uh, your cameras right at the bottom got a thunderstorm moving in I wanted to show you uh, on the app how you can traverse this camera as well I'm just gonna put it on the floor so obviously when you come up to the camera you're gonna to want to turn it on which is this button right here okay so red light just came on and shows that the camera is coming on And I'm gonna go to my app. You gotta wait for that to turn blue. And then you know it's connected to 4G at that point. So now it's connected. So we're gonna go to the Yukon app online. And now I'm going to show you to traverse. You hit that button right here. And you can traverse the camera. Just like that. We'll go back. We'll go down. Up. Super easy. That's just my setup. Obviously you can set this up however you want to on the tree, but this is just the easiest way for me to maneuver the camera around in one piece without having to, you know, remove the camera and the uh, solar panel and everything. It's a pretty sweet camera. So, 
I'm going to go ahead and uh, get this set up this week out in the woods and then I'll be bringing you uh, pictures and video from this camera for the entire hunting season. So I'm looking forward to trying it out. If you guys are interested, there's a link in the description below. Feel free to check them out. Thanks for watching everybody. Have a good one.